Hi there, it's Carl here from Cleaning How To and in this video I'm going to teach you how to clean a sheepskin rug yourself at home. I'm here in our rug cleaning facility rugspa.ie here in Dublin where I specialise in fine fabric, antique rug and wool cleaning. So in today's video I'm going to teach you how to clean a sheepskin rug yourself at home. Okay, so to clean your sheepskin you're going to need a bucket of water or a sprayer, a wet dry vacuum, a sponge or microfiber cloth, a pet grooming brush, and some baby shampoo. Though I'm using a fine fabric shampoo, baby shampoo is absolutely fine. The first thing we're gonna do is shake out the rug to remove as much of the dry soil as possible. Now obviously do this outside and shake out as much of the grit as you can. After that, we're going to use our wet dry vacuum cleaner to vacuum down the rug. After shaking the heavy dirt out of the rug, I'm then going to use the wide spade of my wet dry vacuum cleaner to vacuum the rest of the dirt out of the rug. The reason I'm using the wide spade is that it will allow the fibers of the rug to go into the vacuum head and allow them to release into the vacuum. Any bits of dry dirt that are stuck, I'm gonna use my grooming brush to groom the pile and then use the vacuum to remove them. Okay, now I have a bucket with roughly five liters of water in it and I also have a microfiber cleaning mitt. Now, in place of a microfiber cleaning mitt, a microfiber towel or a sponge will do. I'm now gonna pour in my rug cleaning shampoo, though if you have baby shampoo, that's absolutely fine. Even better if you can get a wool cleaner, but in the absence of that, baby shampoo is fine. I'm gonna go ahead and put about 50 mils of my rug cleaning shampoo into the bucket. I'm gonna put my gloves on in one second, mix it around, and then start to wipe down the rug. Okay, I've got my gloves on now, so, I'm going to liberally apply the cleaning solution to the rug and work it in. Don't be shy with it. Allow enough to penetrate and loosen the soils in the rug. because we're gonna remove all this moisture now in two minutes with our shop vac. You can groom the rug back a little bit just to see how you're getting on. And that looks like it's going really well. So we're just gonna to continue to sponge the rug through and work the cleaning agent into the rug. Now that we've sponged down the rug, I'm going to then rinse out the slurry with the shop vac. Okay, so we've rinsed the slurry out. I'm gonna continue the process until we've worked my way through the entire rug, and then I'm gonna get the rug dry. Okay, so the entire rug is after taking me about an hour to clean and then it's been up on our drying racks drying. What remains is for me to groom the rug now and reset the pile, which I'm using my pet grooming brush for. So I'm gonna keep grooming the rug through in a north-south and east-west fashion to restore the fluffiness to the pile. <laughs> 